So, we're back again. We finished Phantom Menace. We met Baby Anakin, Grumpy Padawan Obi-Wan, and very handsome and <clears throat> very dead Master Gigon. Yeah, Gigon dying? I feel like that was a very big loss for the entire galaxy. That might sound dramatic, but he seemed to be the right person to mentor young Anakin. Big Anakin is my Padawan learner. But instead, the task now falls to a recently promoted Obi-Wan. You will be a Jedi. I promise. Was Guy gone dying the beginning of the end for the Jedi? For young Anakin Skywalker? And the start of the Empire, the Emperor, and of course, Darth Vader. Anakin! Anakin! Well, only one way to find out, because we're watching. Because it's probably gonna be an older Anakin, at least I hope. He can't be a baby forever, even though I love baby Anakin. But still! A long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. Never gets old. Never gets old. Mm. Yes! We're back, baby! Oh, Anakin! Obi-Wan! Oh, I hope they both have grown emotionally. Physically, <laughs> episode two, Attack of the Clones. I'm gonna miss Liam Neeson, Guy Gone. I know his name now. There is unrest in the Galactic Senate. Several thousand solar systems have declared their intentions to leave the Republic. This separatist movement, under the leadership of the mysterious Count Duco, has made it difficult for the limited number of Jedi Knights to maintain peace and order in the galaxy. Senator Amidala, the former Queen of Naboo, former, is returning to the Galactic Senate to vote on the critical issue of creating an army of the Republic to assist the overwhelmed Jedi. What do you mean, former? Why is she not a queen anymore? Well, has she stepped away? Oh, so many questions already. <laughs> this movie is like two and a half hours long, so I'll be sitting here for a while. Oh, give me Anakin. I want to see Anakin. I want to see Obi-Wan. Ah, oh, Ian McGregor. Daddy Chow. Senator, we're making our final approach into Coruscant. <gasps> That's the queen. It's you! I recognize your voice, young lady! How old is she anyway, Padme? I mean, in the first one, she was very young. <gasps> R2-D2? Is that you, my friend? That's gotta be my R2-D2. We made it. I guess I was wrong. There was no danger at all. Okay, nobody cares. <laughs> oh! No. Oh! It was her body double? That's not Kara Knightley. Kara Knightley was the previous copycat of the Queen. That is not Kara Knightley. Kara Knightley. <clears throat> nobody cares about her. <laughs> if she's not Kara Knightley, nobody cares. <laughs> so, hey, girl, how you doing? Glad you're not dead. Goodbye. Wanna be wish Kara Knightley? <laughs> Shouldn't have come back. This vote is very important. You did your duty. Corday did hers. Now come. Come on. Put your big girl pants on. Come on. You can't stop now. She would have died for nothing. Much longer I can hold off the vote, my friend. Oh no. My negotiations 
will not fail. Okay, time has not been nice to you, my friend. If you are really my friend, because he tricked Senator Amidala, Padme, used a vote of no confidence in the Senate, but then he was elected, nominated, then elected, and now he is very comfortably sitting on his little throne, but his voice reminds me a lot of the Sith. A lot of Master Sith. Hmm. Is this the Emperor? Is, is, is this like the Emperor putting up a front? I don't trust him. I really don't. If they do, you must realize there aren't enough Jedi to protect the Republic. Uh-huh. Do you think it will really come to war? Well, if it's up to you, probably. Mm, I don't trust him. The side clouds everything. Impossible to see. The future is. Well, that is concerning, because if he can't see into the future, that means we're pretty far along with the dark side, and that should be all you need to know. I think the Count Dooku was behind it. Oh. He's a political idealist, not a murderer. Mm, sometimes they coexist. You know, my lady, Count Dooku was once a Jedi. He couldn't assassinate anyone. It's not in his character. Mm, don't say that too quickly, because the Jedi's can be tempted to the dark side, you know? So, why would you say that, you know? You know how dangerous it is to be using the Force, how tempting the dark side can be, so... Ah, Samuel L. Jackson, you're too positive right now! In grave danger, you are... Okay, you don't have to say it like that. I realize all too well that additional security might be disruptive for you. Yoda doesn't trust him either. I could see it in his eyes. Yoda's on our team. We don't trust him. He's being too dismissive of it. Is the situation really that serious? Bitch! <laughs> Maybe I'm reading this all wrong, but I don't trust him and I recognize his voice. He's part of the Sith. They have someone you're familiar with. An old friend, like... Master Kenobi. Yes! Obi. Do it for me, what? lady, please. Oh, no problem. The nope. Of losing you is unbearable. Oh, please. Oh, please, you liar! Liar! No, 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 no. They don't put the eerie music when you talk in for nothing, sir. I recognize. <gasps> you seem a little on edge. Oh, my God! Not at all. I haven't felt you this tense since, since we fell into that nest of gum Oh! 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 I can take them both. <laughs> in a fight! In a fight! <laughs> Is this Anakin? This has gotta be Anakin. Look at him. Look at him. He's so tall. Oh my god! Annie! Okay, sorry. Sorry. Don't fangirl. Oh wait, what? You look great with the Jesus hair. My gosh. <laughs> He's beautiful! You fell into that nightmare, Master, and I rescued you, remember? He's definitely Anakin. He's just a sassy. <laughs> You're sweating. Oh. Relax. Take a deep breath. I can't. I can't. I haven't seen her in ten years, Master. <gasps> oh. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm distracted by their beauty. And the little laugh he did, like, <laughs> it reminded me so much of the older Obi-Wan. I think he's really coming into his own here in this movie. Oh god, I hope so. I really wanted some character development for him. But he's the master now. I'm so excited. You got no idea. I'm talking even more than usual. I am deeply sorry. It's just I am excited. And oh, he hasn't seen Padme in so many years. How many years was it? I haven't seen her. Ten years, Master. Ten years, so what, he's like 19, 20? How old is Padme? Hmm. Oh my god, guys. Anakin is... is pfft, he's handsome. Ho ho ho! Jesus. Obi? Obi? I knew it was Jar Jar! Good to see you again, Jar Jar. Senator Padme! <gasps> Sapalo's here. Looky, looky, Senator. Oh my god, here we go. Oh, reunion. Reunion! Oh, this. Oh, it's a he's nervous. to see you again, my lady. Annie? My goodness, you've grown. So have you. Grown more beautiful, Annie. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> oh no, 
he's still the same silly little kid. Are you an angel? Okay, Riz Master Anakin, how old are you? How old are you? How old is Padme? Because I think she's a little bit older than you. Is this appropriate? <laughs> Padme? Padme, he's a child, okay? He's a child. <laughs> I'm 20, so I can't fuck with you. You're 20? Yeah. It's okay, no one has to know, baby girl. Grown more beautiful? Why would you why would you start with that? That's just so awkward, especially in the middle of everyone. You're not alone. Ugh, it's, if I were a bystander, if I were Obi-Wan, I'd giggle, but I'd be feeling so awkward. Well, for a second. Oh yep, yeah, he is! <laughs> That's me! <laughs> I don't need more security, I need answers. I want to know who's trying to kill me. Me too. We're here to protect you, Senator. Not to start an investigation. We'll find out who's trying to kill you, Padawan. <laughs> we will not exceed our mandate, my young Padawan learner. Yeah, no. you. Oh, wow. Annie. He's far more brash as an apprentice than Obi-Wan was. Because Obi-Wan was a very, hmm, well, good boy. Let's just simplify it. He was a very good boy and he was almost a little bit uptight and, and stood by the Jedi teachings to a fault. Even though his own master, Gaigon, was a little bit cheeky at some time. I believe Gaigon is exactly what a Jedi should be. I really enjoyed that character. But he, Obi-Wan, really has to learn to deal with somebody as brash <laughs> as Annie. And that's a whole other task because it's so far from what Obi-Wan was as an apprentice, but he is just going right in. And I think he just really wants to make a good impression on Padme because maybe he's in love with her. I think so, but maybe he should be a little bit more kept in line because we know what happens. But, but uh, I don't fault him because he wasn't very nicely treated by the Jedi's when he was first introduced, I feel. We will not go through this exercise again, Anakin. <laughs> We've been through that often, far more than you would know. <laughs> we'll pay attention to my leader. Uh-huh. Why? What? The disrespect. Why else do you think we were assigned to work not to find the killer? Oh. Protection is a job for local security, not Jedi. Okay, okay, you can have this conversation. But maybe don't do it in front of the person you are meant to protect. That's priority number one, protect. But don't discuss this, because it seems very unprofessional to discuss this in front of, let's say, your charges. He d might have a point, but he's not going the right way about it, because he's disrespecting his master Obi-Wan in front of others, and I don't like that. We will do exactly as the Council has instructed. He's still... Good boy, Obi-Wan. And you will learn your place, young one. Yeah. He's gotta learn to listen first before he can actually lead. She hardly even recognized me, Jar Jar. No, she immediately did. Why are you being pouty? She immediately went, Annie, is that you? You have grown so much. What do you mean? She definitely recognized you. What did you expect her to do? Like, tackle you to the ground and make out with you? Like... Maybe that's what she wanted to do, but what, what do you expect, Annie? I honestly, I really enjoy the little struggle between Obi-Wan and Anakin. It's a very intriguing interaction to watch. I've thought about her every day since we parted. Oh my god, no. She's Annie. Me completely. Annie. She was pleased to see us. Yeah. Security. And this is not priority, Annie. Aren't you a Jedi in the first place? Can Jedi fall in love? Aren't they sworn to be a Jedi? What's that about? I hit the ship, but they used a decoy. Take these. Who's the client? Yeah, they're very poisonous. Oh my god. Why are you trying to assassinate her? Who wants to assassinate her? Any activity up here? Quiet as a tomb. Sorry, I keep pausing a lot and I keep talking. I realize that, but I'm intrigued. Obi-Wan is in beautiful white, like Luke was in the very first movie, A New Hope. He's in completely white attire. And then you have Anakin. Dressed in all black. Mm. Oh, foreshadowing. Oh, that's foreshadowing. You were using her as bait. It was her idea. Oh. Don't worry, no harm will come to her. Ooh. I can sense everything going on in that room. 
Okay, Padme and Annie have been speaking a little bit behind Obi-Wan's back, cooking up this plan. So again, he is rejecting his leadership a bit. Possibly. Oh, he's so handsome. <laughs> I can't, Jesus Christ. You look tired. Because <laughs> I am. <laughs> Don't sleep well anymore. Because of your mother. Oh! Do you miss her? I don't know why I keep dreaming about her. I'd much rather dream about Padme. Stop! Intoxicating. This is embarrassing! You've made a commitment to the Jedi Order, a commitment not easily broken. Yeah, he has the commitment I mentioned to the Jedi. So, yeah, it's, it's sort of, it's not just sort of, it's very sad, but, but falling in love is a distraction. So you can't really focus completely to the force. You can't surrender completely to the force in that regard. So, uh, but uh, can you stop? He's a teenage boy. He's a teenage boy. I get it. I get it. He's obsessed. I get it. Nah, I knew it. Oh, those are disgusting. Oh my, oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, where are the Jedi senses? Besides, you're generalizing. Can you stop stop the philosophical debate and, and look into the senses? My, oh! I sense it too. Thank you, thank you, thank you, idiots! Stop dick fencing and protect your charges! Oh my god, stop! You nearly beheaded her! Oh! Oh me! Oh my god! What a bad! <laughs> the wind come on help your master annie oh my god okay we're in traffic yeah i'm sorry okay well he is an easier target i gotta give it that no obi ah oh my god best pilot in the galaxy come on yay teamwork makes the dream work what took you so long <laughs> well you know master i couldn't find this leader that i really liked Oh! Okay, this is awful! Just awful, Annie! Hold on, Annie. <laughs> I love Obi! He's so stressed! <laughs> you know I don't like it when you do that. Sorry, Master. <laughs> it's like my mom while you're driving and your mother is like, I don't like it when you do that! Don't make that turn too quick! Don't! You're going too fast! Like, what you're doing is suicide! He's such a mom passenger! <laughs> How many times have I told you? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> How many times have I told you? I mean, they bicker a lot, but they definitely care about each other. Where are you going? You went that way. This is a shortcut. I think. Anakin is taking the lead so many times over Obi-Wan. He does it constantly, and Obi-Wan does push back, often telling Anakin to respect his own leadership, but he often just blows it in the wind and does what he wants anyway. I feel like maybe if Gaigon was the actual Jedi Master for Anakin, he would have respected it a little bit more. Because we have to remember, Obi-Wan was just an apprentice, and then he overcame his trials, but he immediately started teaching Anakin. Maybe if he had a little bit more time to develop himself and his leadership qualities, maybe this dynamic would have been very different, and maybe Gaigon would have been a better fit for Anakin to keep it more under control. Because now he is completely walking over Obi-Wan. It makes sense to what the narrative is doing and where we will eventually end up as Anakin, as Darth Vader. You just can't help but ponder about what would have happened if Gaigon was actually still alive. Well, you've lost him. <laughs> He's so sassy, I'm Obi. Sorry, Master. I love Obi. He went completely the other way. <laughs> Once again, you proved if you'll excuse me. Oh my god! I hate it when he does that. I bet you do. I absolutely adore Obi-Wan. But my god, he has no control over his apprentice at all. He's like a feral cat, Anakin. <laughs> oh! Really? Another blue lightsaber lost? Oh, oh well, thank god for Obi-Wan. Oh! Oh no! Don't 
tell me we have casualties. No way, because dad would be very reckless of Anakin. Stop, stop. <laughs> Annie, don't tell me. Okay, lucky. You are very lucky, because dad could have ended very badly. That was irresponsible. Anakin, that was irresponsible. Obi, control your feral cat. Imagine if this was your son. <laughs> I'm just imagining it. She went into the club, Master. Patience. Use the force. Think next time. Try not to lose it. He's very calm. And that obviously is Obi-Wan. But he's very calm. <laughs> I would have snapped. <laughs> I would have not been so patient with Anakin Skywalker. No, 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 no. He's very patient. I like that about Obi-Wan. But you gotta really put in perspective that in the previous movie, in the previous prequel, that Guy Gon really took the forefront with everything. And Obi-Wan was sort of in the back, taking it all in, listening. But now the roles are reversed and Obi-Wan, now as master, is still in the background. <laughs> I thought this would be his chance to shine. I hope it is. But you can really see the difference what kind of apprentice obi-wan was and anakin is my god <laughs> yes master this weapon is your life why do i get the feeling you're going to be the death of me you're the closest thing i have to a father oh i am trying no you're not trying his nature gets the better of him you're like a father to me that's sweet where are you going master for a drink Oh, Obi-Wan Kenobi, right up my alley, baby. <laughs> it reminds me of the bar he went in with Luke. Oh, look at that man. I want to sell me death sticks. I don't want to sell you death sticks. <laughs> you want to go home and rethink your life. I want to go home and rethink my life. <laughs> Good job, Obi. Use the force. He's so cute. I love him. No, no, no. He's 19, ladies. He's a baby. Oh, no. Annie, you're being hunted. Oh, he's close. Nice, Obi-Wan. She went after Obi. Maybe she thought he was the weaker of the two. Well, that's your first mistake. <laughs> Jedi business. Go back to your drinks. Nice. Oh, <laughs> go back to your drinks. Who hired you? Tell us. Easy, Annie. Tell us now. It was a bounty hunter called... Oh, she was killed. Oh. oh, they don't want her to tell. What about Senator Amidala? She will still need protecting. Handle that. Your Padawan will. <laughs> I don't think that's the best option, to be quite honest with you. Oh, no. Oh, he likes that. Oh, no. I. He, he, he thinks the same as I do. He's like, no, 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 no. He's gonna get distracted. You know what I mean. Oh, no. You be responsible. Oh, he's he's a 19-year-old teenager. What, what can we expect? <laughs> Go to the Senate and ask Chancellor Palpatine to speak with her about this matter. <sighs> Palpatine is not to be trusted, though. And so, they've finally given you an assignment. Your patience has paid off. We will be watching your career with great interest. Don't tell me he's gonna bring Anakin into the dark side. I don't like this. Your guidance more than my patience. I don't like this. Your guidance? Don't guide him to anything. I think this is the future emperor. He needs an apprentice too. There's always two. There's always two and he wants Anakin. Ah! I see you becoming the greatest of all Jedi, Anakin. Even more powerful than Master Yoda. Oh man, don't butter him up like that. Of course you're going to be weak for that. Like, oh, this guy thinks I have the potential to be the best Jedi in the world, in all of the worlds. And maybe this is even a situation of, okay, this guy thinks I have the potential to be the best Jedi in the world. Meanwhile, the Jedi Knights have been disproving of me since the very beginning. They didn't even want to train me. And now they've only given me my first assignment. They don't trust me. While meanwhile, this guy trusts the hell out of me. It's an easy choice to make who I want to be with. I want to support who I want to be with and train and who actually believes in me. This guy does. The Jedi Knights, pff, they haven't been treating me well at all. Oh man, I can see the 
appeal for Anakin. I am concerned for my Padawan. Me too. If the prophecy is true, your apprentice is the only one who can bring the Force back into balance. Chosen one. Representative Binks, huh? I know I can count on you. I need to be taking on this a heavy burden. He really moved up in the world. Jar Jar, I don't wish to hold you up. <laughs> but she says what everyone was thinking. Like, okay, enough, thank you, bye-bye. <laughs> I haven't worked for a year to defeat the Military Creation Act, to not be here when its fate is decided. Sometimes we must let go of our pride and do what is requested of us. <laughs> You're one to talk, Anakin Skywalker, and do what is requested of us. You hush. You hush. You've grown up. No, he hasn't. The one manages not to see it. Oh, wow. He really is a little bit bitter. Not bitter, but I think he really just sees Obi-Wan as a father figure at this point, and he just really wants Obi-Wan to recognize his own abilities. I'm really ahead of him. <laughs> but he feels that I'm too unpredictable. Yeah. You move on. You're arrogant. Okay. He's overly critical. Okay. He never listens. He, he doesn't understand. It's not fair. He's a child, still. Our mentors have a way of seeing more of our faults than we would like. It's the only way we grow. Yeah, that's true. Don't try to grow up too fast. But I am grown up. <laughs> oh God, no, I knew this would happen. You said it yourself. Stop, Annie. Annie! Don't look at me like that. Yep, you're a child, Annie! It makes me feel uncomfortable. Thank you, Padme. Thank you, me too, Padme. Sorry. You're a child, Annie! Stop it! <laughs> Stop trying to be the Riz Master! It's really uncomfortable! <laughs> Don't do anything without first consulting either myself or the Council. Yes, Master. Uh-huh. I'll get to the bottom of this plot quickly, milady. You'll be back here in no time. <sighs> I just really enjoy how calm and collected Obi-Wan is. It's very peaceful. I like it. I'm thinking I'm gonna go for Obi-Wan. <laughs> Anakin, may the Force be with you. With you, man. They are so cute! Look at the little smile of Obi-Wan! They love each other! I'm sad they separate. I like their dynamic. But maybe Obi-Wan has a chance to shine more. Don't worry, we have our two with us. <laughs> I do hope he doesn't try anything foolish. Well... I'd be more concerned about her doing something than him. Oh god. They strengthen each other, don't they? Two little rebels together? Oh, this is going to be chaos unleashed. <laughs> can't wait, can't wait to see it. Oh, is that a little diner of some sort? That's so cute! Obi-Wan! Aww! Oh, like um, look how cute Obi-Wan is! Oh, how adorable! Oh, the big hug! What can I do for you? Oh, he's beautiful. Tell me what this is. Don't need focus on symbol. I recognize his voice somewhere, but I can't. It's on the tip of my tongue, but I can't think of the name. I think this is a familiar actor who is voicing him too. Feel free to tell me in the comments. They're cloners. Damn good ones too. Cloners? cloners. Are they friendly? Oh, it depends. Depends on what decks. Yeah. On how good your manners are. Well, how big your what? How big your what is? Whoa, 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 whoa. how big your uh, <laughs> that's all we need good manners and a big <laughs> you do realize I am joking. Pocketbook is <laughs> pocketbook. Oh, okay. I thought, uh, wow, my brain went somewhere else entirely. Okay. Look at him on a date. It must be difficult having sworn your love to the Jedi, not being able to visit the places you like or do the things you like. He never really had a choice, now did he? Because if you really think about it, he starts off as a slave. His life starts off being a slave. But then he's taken with Gaigon to the Jedi. Should be a better life, but again, he has no choice. He has no choice of doing the things he actually would want to do with his life if you think about it, because he's sworn to the Jedi now. So essentially, he's also a slave to the Force and the Jedi. That's sad. He's never really had an opportunity to just simply being himself. I'll be with the people that I love. Are you allowed to love? Aww. Attachments for men. 
I like his acting. I like the little, little shy but hopeful little little smirks or smiles. I like this actor. I do. He, he does a good job, I think. Possession is forbidden. Compassion, which I would define as unconditional love. Oh, I like so him. So you might say that we are encouraged to love. <laughs> Wrist master. You're exactly the way I remember you in my dreams. Honey. Honey? Honey? I know it's tempting. I mean, if they're both consenting adults. Use your feelings, you must. Baby Jedi's. Younglings. This is adorable. A visitor we have. This is adorable. Hello, Master Obi-Wan. Hi. Hello. What help can I be, Obi-Wan? Hmm? Hmm? Lost a planet, Master Obi Wan has. This is so cute. How embarrassing. How <laughs> embarrassing. This is adorable. Hear your mind. Oh, it's, it's going to be a teaching friend. moment. This is great. I like this. To be here. But it isn't. Gravity is pulling all the stars in the area towards this spot. Because someone erased it from the archive memory. Truly wonderful, the mind of a child is. Oh, man. That one is right. Who could empty information from the archives? That's impossible, isn't it? Only a Jedi could have erased those files. What about that Jedi that was previously a Jedi that Samuel L. Jackson mentioned, like, Oh, he couldn't harm a fly. He used to be a Jedi. What if it's that Jedi? Oh, it's the beautiful city of Naboo. It's gorgeous, reminds me of Italy. Yep, definitely Italy. I wasn't the youngest queen ever elected, but now that I think back on it, I'm not sure I was old enough. Oh, so the queens are elected too. So she isn't really royalty. Queens are elected. So that's why she isn't a queen anymore. That makes sense. I'm glad that you chose to serve. We obviously have ministers and presidents who give up their power after most of the time, two semesters. But how hard would it be to first have all of this power and then to have to give it up to the next person? I mean, this is how democracy works and it's great. Love it. But I could see why dictators want to hold on to that power because it's hard to step away because essentially you're at the top and then once your semester is over, then you gotta serve somebody else again. And if that is not in your nature, that's uh, why dictatorships happen. <laughs> I see, oh, Jesus. The day we stop believing democracy can work is the day we lose it. In the meantime, we must consider your own safety. What is your suggestion, Master Jedi? Oh, Anakin's not a Jedi. Wow. He's still a Padawan learner. Oh, oh why would you have to say that? Oh, that's diminishing him. I mean, she's right. Let him have his moment. I understand why he would feel bothered about that. Because he's very proud for this assignment. And especially after the conversation that they had, that he feels frustrated in his role. This would have been a, like a nice little pat on his shoulder. Ooh, I think he's not happy about this. But I was thinking... Hold on a minute. Excuse me. I was thinking I would stay in... <laughs> Excuse me. I'm in charge of security here, my lady. And this is my home. I know it very well. That is why we're here. He's just pissed off because you diminished his role. Oh, oh, oh. Two strong characters are gonna butt heads. Sorry, my lady. Oh. Oh. I did not expect that. We're just gonna leave the cute little drone? Well, that's just rude, Obi-Wan. Whoa. Master Jedi. Hi! The Prime Minister is expecting you. I'm disturbed. I'm expected? Of course, he is anxious to meet you. Okay, thank you. You will be delighted to hear that we are on schedule. A thousand units are ready with a million more well on the way. Please tell your master, Cypher Diaz, that his order will be met on time. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! Order? Cypher di- Oh my god. This is what we have been worried about. Oh! Army order? Are you- This is an army order, right? And he is mistaking Obi-Wan Kenobi to be in league with this other master. That he's informed with the plan. What a dummy. What a dummy. What? 
I'm sorry, it's Master... Master Cypher Dias was killed almost ten years ago. But I'm sure he would have been proud of the army we've built for him. What? The army? Attack of the clones. But you must be anxious to inspect the units for yourself. That's why I'm here. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Just to inspect the clones. What have we stumbled into, Obi-Wan? Oh, that, that's Venice. See, this is Venice. Are you joking? Are you kidding? That's Venice. Oh, wow. Lake Como? Wait, this is Lake Como. I love the water. This is beautiful. This is so beautiful. We used to lie out on the sand and let the sun dry us. Here everything is soft. Oh. Why did you look at her chest when you said that? I mean... Booty, show me the booty, give me the booty. I'll stop. Smooth. So, uh, stop! Eddie! You're trying to seduce her! Oh my god! I feel so awkward. Stop! Padme! Padme! He's a- oh, oh no, he's getting somewhere, isn't he? I can't watch this. No. Padme. Oh my god, no! Yes? No, oh. I don't know how I feel about this. No. Oh my god, she doesn't either. <laughs> I'm sorry. Access denied. <laughs> he's gonna feel so- <laughs> I'm sorry. Fett demanded only one thing, an unaltered clone for himself. Curious, isn't it? Unaltered? Uh-huh. To meet this Django Fett. I would be very happy to arrange it for you. Thank you. <laughs> they are trying to impress Obi-Wan so much while he has just stumbled into all of this. Very Obi-Wan Kenobi. <laughs> These are these are the stormtroopers. Shut up. You shut up. You shut up right now. Magnificent. Oh my god, they are all clones? The stormtroopers are clones? His fear is older than I. Very cute. Alright, I get the picture. <laughs> I knew that would happen! We need a system where the politicians sit down and discuss the problem and then do it. That's exactly what we do. Yeah, is that not the, happening the now? people don't always agree. Yeah. Well, then they should be made to. Whoa. By whom? Who's gonna make them? I don't know. Someone. You? Of course not me. Someone wise. Right. And who do you know is somebody wise? With not their own best interests at heart instead. Who do you pick for such an important role who has essentially more power than the whole democracy itself? It doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. Sounds an awful lot like a dictatorship to me. Yeah. If it works. Ooh, that's bad. <laughs> You're making fun of me. Mm, no, no. no. I'd be much too frightened to tease a senator. <laughs> no, no, no. There was a hidden truth in that. You can't laugh it off like that. There was a hidden truth, Annie. Uh, you can be cute all you want, Mister, because he's very cute. But no. What are, are they frolicking in the? <laughs> Stop! What is this scene? What is this? Oh, he's fine. Oh, please, he's fine. He's doing that on purpose. Oh, that corset. She's beautiful! That dress is everything. Are you alright? I knew it. Little shit. Little shit. Okay, why is it? Okay, we're, we're seeing the romance. You you said you weren't going to do that. Pat me! Oh, they are. Well, at least you didn't kiss him. Shouldn't have done that. I can roll on top of him, but... <laughs> Come on, Pat me! Ay, ay, ay. Is your father here? He wanted a child. Yep. He just wanted a child. But the child is the clone. Don Luis here. Oh, aggressive negotiations with that. Uh, well, negotiations with a lightsaber. <laughs> <laughs> aggressive negotiations, okay. If Mr. Obi-Wan caught me doing this, he'd be very grumpy. <laughs> Why is he adorable? Oh, he cut it for her. That's cute. Stop. You can see how much Padme actually likes him. Shit. Whoa, girl, what are you wearing? He's a teenage boy! What are you wearing? He can't handle all of that. 
I can't handle all of that. Jesus! This is like the Leia outfit. A day has gone by when I haven't thought of you. Jeez. I'm in agony. Wow. The closer I get to you, the worse it gets. I can't breathe. <laughs> Shit. I'm haunted by the kiss that you should never have given me. Oh my god. My heart is beating. Anakin! Hoping that that kiss will not become a scar. Gee! You are in my very soul, tormenting me. I shouldn't love it. But my god, Anakin! There's guys that tell you, yeah, I kind of like you. And then there's Anakin. <laughs> it's just corny, it's cheesy, don't be tempted, you're not tempted. Nope. Nope. Why is he so romantic? That's not fair. That's not fair. Can I do? I will do anything that you ask. Well. <laughs> okay. We live in a real world. Come back to it. I'm a senator. Okay, you're gonna break up. Se essentially break up with him while wearing that? How is that fair towards Anakin? Oh, come on. If you have the common decency, at least don't dress like that. You're just torturing him. No wonder he's suffering. <laughs> Look at you. No wonder he's suffering. Poor Annie. You are asking me to be rational. Well, yeah. That is something I know I cannot do. <laughs> well, yeah. I will not give in to this. I will. Sorry. 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 <laughs> that just slipped out. <laughs> We could keep it a secret. I couldn't do that. I know, you couldn't. Could you, Anakin? Could you live like that? He could, but I don't think you could. I think he's the kind of person who would be willing to sacrifice everything just to be with Padme. But she... She has a different mindset. I think for him, it's all or nothing. And he would put her as a priority. But I think Padme, as a very clever woman that she is, has other priorities than just love. But I think for him, it's it's a very, very serious matter. And she might have feelings for him, but I think his are so strong that he would do anything, anything. No, you're right. No, I don't know. You're just saying that. No, you're just saying that because she doesn't want to. You're trying to respect her decision, but you don't agree with it. Oh, wow. No master, there appears to be no motive! It's odd. Do not assume anything, Obi-Wan, if you are to discover the real villains behind this. I think it's the counselor. I forgot his name. Palpatine? I think he's behind of all of this. Or at least he's in connection with it in some regards. I think it's him. I think he's the mastermind because I believe him to be Sith. The Sith. They say Master Sabatee has placed an order for a clone army at the request of the Senate almost ten years ago. Hello? Hello? No. No, no. Stop. No. I'm sorry, I know it's a nightmare, but my god. <laughs> you were all thinking it. Shut up. Shut up. You were thinking it. I know I'm disobeying my mandate to protect you, Senator, but I have to go. Oh, free will. I'll go with you. Okay. I'm sorry, I don't have a choice. Well, you do, but I can't argue with your choice that you have made. Yes, no. Okay, rude. Boba, get on board. Boba? Oh, is that Boba Fett, the young kid? Because he's Django, and Boba Fett was the one who was actually at the party of Jabba the Hutt. Oh, yes, the kicks are back. I love his little kicks. He's so dramatic. That's a special move. Kicking the hell out of them. Ooh! <laughs> Those kicks are sending me! Oh, feck. Oh, Obi. <laughs> the special effects are everything. <gasps> We're back. Oh, are we gonna see his mother? I'm wondering how she fared. I don't think it went well. Oh, I'm wondering if this triggering for Anakin... No anger. Oh! Lenny. Oh my god. You are Lenny! It is you! Yep, the engineer. Oh, wow. I mean, he's a slaver. 
And yet you feel some sort of connection between them. That is so sad. She's not mine no more. I sold her. What? Sold her. Years ago. What happened? Believe it kidding? or not, I heard he freed her and married her. But she, she's hurting. Blast, this is why I hate flying. <laughs> you do hate flying. He's such a grumpy old mom. I adore him. He's cold. What a beautiful man. <laughs> like cuddling himself. He's like, I'm a little bit chilly. Is this Luke's farm? Hello. Maybe of service. Oh, see. Three PM. This is the farm. Owen Lars. This is my girlfriend, Baru. Cleek Lars. Shmi is my wife. The young couple. It's the uncle and the aunt of Luke. Oh my god! Of course, that's how they know Annie. Oh! That's intriguing because I was wondering about that plot line. Like, why, why did Luke have an uncle and an aunt, but there was no connection? Because Anakin seemed to be an only child with his slave mother. Oh! It's all coming together. Tracks, she was about halfway home. I'm sorry I'm interrupting, but just this scene, the environment. Remember that first conversation with Luke? Oh, it feels nostalgic in a way. Oh my gosh. When they took her, 30 of us went out after her. Four of us came back. There's little hope she's lasted. Shut up! No. Oh, Anakin is not gonna sit well with that. Where are you going? Well, what do you think? Find my mother. Her dresses are amazing. And her hair, it's... I keep fawning over her outfits. Anakin. <laughs> Anakin. You sounded like his mom just now. Anakin. Anakin. <laughs> oh, I'm glad we're going after his mom, though, because that seemed like an un unfinished business. Oh my goodness. Must persuade the Commerce Guild and the Corporate Alliance to sign the treaty. We'll rally to our cause with your support, gentlemen. Sauron? It is! Amazing actor. Amazing actor. I'm glad to see him here. The Jedi will be overwhelmed. I recognize that voice. What? Stop it. Stop it. No. Oh. Oh, how is she going to react to seeing his, her son again? Oh my gosh. Did you? Don't tell me she dies. You're safe. He looks so handsome. <laughs> he does. Oh, that's so sweet. I missed you. Oh, this is sad. I am complete. Oh my gosh. I bet you feel complete after so long. I love She's going to die, isn't she? Stay with me, Mom. Everything. Not now. I, I love Oh, this is so heartbreaking. No, she hold on. She holds, uh, this is what always happens. They hold on for the entire time. And when they're about to be rescued, they die. Because it was just, ah, uh, why does this always happen? Why can't one of them ever live? It's so annoying. I feel for them, it's sad. What is that going to do to his mindset? That can't bode well. Why? She was about to be rescued. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Anger. Oh. Anakin. No! Guy gone. Something terrible has happened. I hear Darth Vader's team very softly being played in the background. Ta -ta 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 -ta. This is troublesome. I haven't got much time. Anakin? Anakin, do you copy? He's so cute! What he does- I love his little acting, the little movements he has created for Obi-Wan, but he, he keeps, like, pulling his rope over himself. It's adorable! I like that he does that the entire time. It's adorable. This is off. His facial expression is sort of terrifying. I'm good at fixing things. Always was. But you couldn't fix this? Is that your problem? I couldn't. Yeah. Why couldn't I save her? I know I could have. You're not all powerful. Well, I should be. I will be the most powerful Jedi ever. 
He's so young. I will even learn to stop people from dying. Oh my gosh, Anakin. It's all Obi-Wan's fault. No, that's not fair. He's jealous. He's holding me back. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. I'm sorry, I gotta pause. Before, he was arrogant, overconfident, and now he's got his first pushback. That he's not all powerful, and it bit him in the ass in the most terrible, awful way by losing his mother. He's getting a sense of the real world. And he realizes, okay, maybe I'm not the person I think I was. And it's a slap in the face. And now he's blaming Obi-Wan because he feels like he has surpassed Obi-Wan. Maybe in his fighting techniques he has, but his mindset, it's very... It's not balanced. He's not grounded. But I do believe he would have benefited from the tutorship of Gigon. I killed them. I killed them all. They're dead. Yeah. Every single one of them. And not just the men. But the women. Not the children. And the children. Not too. the children! And I slaughtered them like animals. Annie. I hate them. Annie. Oh my god. This is what I mean. His love is so extreme. One extreme or the other. And he loves so much that he is capable to let that love blind everything and destroy everything in its path. To be angry is to be human. <laughs> With the best guy around. What about the people he murdered? What, what murder? murder? He's so dramatic. I adore him. He loves so much. In a way, he has a giant heart, but it bites him. It bites him in the ass. I miss you. Oh my god. So much. I miss her. I miss her. I'm sorry. That's just so sad. I feel like his story is just very sad. I feel like he is fighting his own extreme nature. It's just, ah, I don't know how I feel about this. I feel for him. But what about the people he murdered? Annie, are you just gonna sit here and let him die? He's your friend, your mentor. He's like my father. But you heard Master Windu, he gave me strict orders to stay here. Okay. And I'm going to help Obi-Wan. Okay, I love her. I absolutely love her, but this might not be what he needs. Oh shit. Hi, welcome to Chili's. This is a mistake, a terrible mistake. They've gone too far. This is mad. Right. I thought you were the leader here, Dooku. Uh-huh, Dooku. Had nothing to do with me, I assure you. Qui-Gon always spoke very highly of you. Stop it. Don't bring him into this. Don't, Daddy Master. I wish she were still alive. Same. I think things would have been a lot different if he was. Forget that he was once my apprentice. Just Whoa. Just once his. Wow, all of these generations, oh my goodness. He knew all about the corruption in the Senate, but he would never have gone along with it if he had learned the truth as I have. He did seem very cheeky, but I feel like Gaigon simply had a code of his own. And I still think he would not join you. What if I told you that the Republic was now under the control of the Dark Lord of the Sith? <gasps> I knew it! I knew it! The Jedi would be aware of it. That's not a surprise to me! I wonder the influence of a Sith Lord called Darth City. Ah! Who's clever? Oh, I knew I was right, Sidious! Frickin' knew it! I'm so proud of myself. Give immediately emergency powers to the Supreme Chancellor. No! No! Yar Yar Bings! I love democracy. <laughs> you liar. I love the Republic. Shut up, Sidious. Oh my gosh. Ew. What is this? Ah! Run, 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 run! Woo, you get him, Annie. Woo! Well, bye-bye, Padme. Nice knowing ya. Okay. Okay. Oh, Padme! What about your cape? Be careful with your cape! Almost fell. Oh my god, don't get your Don't try to murder your husband! It's a nightmare! It is! Aren't you? Oh my god. 
Rescue your boy right now, mister! Hey! Don't touch the wifey! Oh! Padme! Oh! oh no! You stop! No! No! Oh my god! You stop! No! I'm so confused. I am too! Oh! Oh no! Oh come on! Oh my god! Shit! Shit! Oh, I knew that. Oh! Had me! Oh! oh my god, why would you do that? You're tricking me. I thought she'd already be done for. Oh! We're getting intimate again. Oh, you you put that away. You put that thing away. Oh! Oh, thank god. Okay, we're free. Oh no, are you serious? Not again. <laughs> Obi Wan's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill you anyway. I want them to team up again, Anakin and Obi Wan. There's not enough of those two together. I've been dying a little bit each day since you came back into my life. Oh my god. I love you. You love me? Yeah, I knew she did. It was obvious for everyone. I thought that we had decided not to fall in love. Well, you can't really help your feelings, can you? That we would be forced to live a lie. She thinks she's dying, Anakin. She wants to she tell you. About to be destroyed anyway. I truly, deeply love you. And before we die, I want you know. I know. <laughs> They're not going to die. No way. He can't because he's about to be Darth Vader. So, <laughs> Obi. Nice to see you, Obi! <laughs> Obi-Wan is gonna kill me! If this doesn't kill me, Obi-Wan will! I was beginning to wonder if you'd got my message. He's so sassy! Then we decided to come and rescue you. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> the way he looks up, like... Good job! Oh, well that's a cute one. Maybe not! Oh no, 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 cr no, that one's worse. That one's worse. Oh my god. Hey! Stop it! Yeah, you deserve that. I'm sorry. I a bad feeling about this. D no shit, Anakin. Ooh! Nice! Okay, use your kick move, Obi Wan. Use it! The real villains are the guards, not the creatures. Oh my god! <laughs> I like that. I like that. He's not fighting with it. He's trying to tame it because he's not the real enemy. Why do I like that about Anakin? There's good in him. Yep, I'm in love with Anakin. Oh my god, stop it. Stop that. That was cheesy. Okay, well, the trio. Why is it always you three? <laughs> is Oh. Ooh, surprise. Yes! Purple? Purple? Oh wow, he's got a purple lightsaber. He is a fancy man. Look at all of these Jedi's. It's so sad that almost none of them are left later. Oh my god! Why he's got purple? I want, I don't want purple. I don't like purple. But he looks good with purple. Oh, look at all of these! This is cool! Look at all the Jedi! I wish there were more Jedi later in Luke's timeline. It's so sad. This is what I want to see. Back to back, baby. Nice! Nice! Thank you! I love you! What a good boy! Such a good boy! I hope nothing happens to the good boy. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Okay, now we gotta kill him. I'm sorry. Boba Fett, though. Oh my god. Oh no, I feel bad. Shit. 
call this a diplomatic solution? No, I call it aggressive negotiations. <sighs> this is such a drag. Literally. <laughs> oh my god, they're outnumbered. Surrender, and your lives will be spared. We will not be hostages to be bartered, Dooku. Dooku. I'm sorry, old friend. Look! Oh, reinforcements! The Stormtroopers! Oh my god, this is insane! This is so insane! Oh, I can't believe they worked with the Jedis! I can't believe this. Are you serious? This is so cool, though. Because we know what- Ah! They're working with the Jedi! This is also just tragic. All these clones will be going with the dark side. Oh my gosh. Boba Fett is born. Oh, that's so incredibly sad. That's heartbreaking. Aim right above the fuel cells. <laughs> oh man. Good call, my young Padawan. <laughs> so cute. See, he trusts you, Anakin. Well, at least we don't have Jar Jar Binks as general. They would have been much safer there. <gasps> the Death Star. Oh, my god, everything is coming together! <laughs> I'm sorry, that just looks funny on his little scooter. <laughs> on his little Vespa. The clones are actually very sad. Just to be born for battle, to be used in wars, it's so incredibly sad. Jesus. Look over there. I love how tiny Obi-Wan seems next to Anakin. Anakin and I can handle this. Well, shit. Ship down. Anakin, don't let your personal feelings get in the way. This is Anakin Skywalker you're talking about. Come on. I need you. If we catch him, we can end this war right now. Oh, what is he going to do? have a job to do. He's going to jump. Put the ship down. He's going to jump. Expelled from the Jedi Order. I can't leave her! Come to your senses! What do you think Padme would do? Oh my god, this is the moment. She would do her duty. Anakin, good. Oh, here we go. <gasps> I'm intrigued. You're gonna pay for all the Jedi that you killed today, Duke. Come together. You're going slowly on the left. Taking now! No! 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 Oh! I recognize that! Yep, he's a bad boy. That's the lightsaber says it all. You're fine. Oh, come on, Obi. Oh, oh! Don't you touch him. Stop. Oh, oh he's got two, too. Oh, look at him. Oh, he's badass. Shit, well, that didn't last long. It's like, like a rave. <laughs> I think he senses that this is a serious battle. Oh! Wait! But he loses another arm with Luke. Are we gonna see Yoda in battle? I wanna see Yoda in battle. Master Yoda, I've become more powerful than any Jedi. Even you. Ooh! He's the Avatar. <laughs> I like that Yoda gets a chance to be in a battle. It is obvious that this contest cannot be decided by our knowledge of the Force by our skills with a light. Yes! I want to see him with a lightsaber. I want to see Yoda with a lightsaber. Come on. Come on. This is everything. Yes! Oh my god, I did not expect that. Stop! You stop! This is so cool! <laughs> Look how fast he is! I did not expect that! This is insane. <laughs> I, I'm overwhelmed! Look at him! What well you have, my old bad one. This oh. is just the beginning. All of these generations, my god. <gasps> oh, come on, you're using them against. That's not fair. Oh, oh look at those two. Yeah, that's gonna work. Oh, boy, that does not bode well. I got a bad feeling about this. You have done well. Aye, aye, aye. I have good news for you, my lord. War has begun. Excellent. Are you 
you serious? Everything is going as planned. Exactly as planned. Oh, I knew it! I knew it! Do you believe what Count Dooku said about Sidious controlling the Senate? Yep! I have to admit that without the clones, it would not have been a victory. Victory? It's just the start. The Shroud of the Dark Side has fallen, begun. The Clone War has. Yeah. My God! Yeah, this is bad. Yay! This is amazing. Yeah, this is going great for the Jedi, I'm sure. Oh no! Oh no! It's in the wrong hands. Come on! Are you serious? It's just like watching a disaster unfold and you can't do anything about it. Are you kidding? Well, at least we're here. Beautiful. They're getting married? Stop. No way. Oh my goodness. This makes me so sad. What happened to Padme? What happened to Padme? We know what happens to Anakin! This is tragic, isn't it? Oh my god. Oh no, guys! This is going to be... This is like a Greek strategy. I can see it coming, but there's nothing I can do! What happens to Padme? Because Anakin becomes Darth Vader. But why does he become Darth Vader? We still don't have an answer to that. There are signs of him becoming Darth Vader. Like killing all of the women and children, for example. But Padme, I feel like something... Oh, something is going to happen with Padme and he goes all dark. Padme has been his weakness. His mother, but his mother is gone now. And Padme. Something is going to happen to Padme. It makes him go berserk. I think. I don't know. Oh my god, guys. Hayden Christensen, is that Anakin? Fine man. A fine man. <laughs> and Joda, can we talk about the fight with Joda? I had hoped, but I did not expect. I like this one. I still miss Gigon. I feel like Liam Neeson was such a powerful presence on screen that he was the best part of that movie, I feel. I sort of missed him in this. And I love Obi-Wan, and I love the way that Ian McGregor well, portrays him. It's very nicely done. But I feel like he still doesn't have enough chances to shine, and it's sad. I feel like he is this mentor type, a supporting role. But I just wish to see more of him. Because now, obviously, I feel like the trilogy is about Anakin. So Obi-Wan has his supporting role. But I just wish to see more of him. Aren't there an Obi-Wan Kenobi series? I think that might be right up my alley. Anakin, my god, he still has the Riz, but he feels so much. And there is so much heart in him. It just... Most of the time, he, he lets those strong emotions get the better of him. And that's... Ultimately, I think that will be his downfall. One more prequel to watch, and then we know what came to be. What came to be of Anakin Skywalker to, for him to become Darth Vader. Ah! I want to learn more! I feel like Obi-Wan really tries his hardest to mentor Anakin Skywalker in the best way that he can. But Anakin has, is such a force to be reckoned with. He's such a menace still. It's proven that his mentorship simply wasn't enough. And that's very incredibly sad. And I feel Obi-Wan later in his life might blame himself. And it's, 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 it's sad. This whole story is actually just so sad. Darth Vader, Anakin's story is very tragic. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here because I've been talking enough and my throat is very dry. Thank you. Oh my God, people. 
Did I like this more than the previous one? Hmm, well, there's a lot of more character development in this, so I gotta give it that. I just lit- I really miss Gaigon. I just wish Gaigon were here. I feel like if he was a part of this galaxy in this point in time, maybe- I mean, it's just one man, I get that. But I feel like he would have influenced Anakin in a very different way than maybe Obi-Wan would have. I miss him. I liked him, and I really liked the previous episode as well with young Anakin. I thought that kid was adorable. But you can really see his transformation from that young kid to Darth Vader, and it's... Ah! It's exciting, it's tragic, I'm here for it. So we're gonna watch the last one, the last prequel, really soon. I'm not sure about the sequels. <laughs> Everybody is so negative about the sequels, it's worrisome. But I don't want to get blasted if I actually end up liking the sequels, because I will be destroyed. <laughs> I know I will! Guys, thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun trying to theorize everything. This is what I do. I like to analyze a lot of the plot and hopefully have it right. Often I don't, sometimes I do. It's fun to theorize like that. Thank you so much. Um, if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like. That really helps me out and lets me know you want more movie reactions. I'm thinking of Stranger Things. I know it's out of the blue, but I've been wanting to watch that series for so long because I haven't. I, I haven't been following the hype, so I'm like, should I watch Stranger Things? I know it's episodes as a series, but still. Anyway, if you want that, let me know in the comments. Subscribe if you for some reason have not already. And guess I will see you in the very next episode of Star Wars. See ya!